welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be showing you how I apply my liquid lipsticks or just like lipsticks in general. A lot of people have asked me the different tricks that I have to putting on lipstick perfectly. Personally, there's no such thing as applying lipstick perfectly. I usually always mess up, but I do have a few tricks that help me clean up my lipstick and make them look perfect. So let's just go ahead and get into it. We're going to get up real nice and close here and I'm just going to get started. So the first thing that I like to do before I apply liquid lipstick every single time is exfoliate and moisturize. These are my two favorite lip exfoliators. This is the e.l.f. lip exfoliator and this is the Tarte lip facial. This one is way more expensive than this one, but they both work the same. So today I'm just gonna go in with the e.l.f. lip exfoliator and it just looks like a regular lipstick, but it's really, really um, grainy and rough. So I like to just go ahead and go in. I spend about a minute just like going back and forth doing this to my lips, getting all that dry skin off. And once that's done, I go ahead and take some makeup wipes. Today I'm using the e.l.f. cleansing cloths, which are my favorite makeup wipes right now, by the way. I just go ahead and wrap it in my finger and then I go ahead and just take it right off. Try not to take off any excess foundation around your mouth. If you do have foundation on, try to just get the lips. And then I like to go in with some sort of moisturizer. Today I'm using the Tarte Quench Lip Rescue in the color Nude. Um, don't mind the deformation. I like left it in my car and it got really melted. Oh! Carefully. Sometimes I use beauty oil, sometimes I just use regular chapsticks. I always change up my lip moisturizers. Today I'm just using that tart one, and you just want to put on a very, very, very little amount. And if you put on too much, take the back of your hand and kiss off the excess. You don't want too much on or else it or else it'll screw up the liquid lipstick. Once the lips are all prepped, I like to take the beauty blender or brush that I used for my foundation and I just go ahead and pat it around the edges of my lips to blend that foundation onto my lips. I don't add any extra foundation, I just use whatever is left on the Beauty Blender. So now your lips should be feeling nice and moisturized and smooth and ready to go. So I'm gonna go in with the liquid lipstick. Today I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick. And this is in the color Seraphine. Seraphine. But it's like a very dark red. I wanted to use a dark color today so you guys can really see what I'm doing. Um, let's just, let's just do it. What I like to do when I first start out is take the applicator out and then kind of wipe off the excess. So I always start in the center of my bottom lip and just work my way outwards. And then I'll usually put my lips together to kind of transfer the color everywhere. And then I'll tighten my lips like this with a little smile and get that bottom line of my lower lip. And then I'll start applying it on the outer edges, really focusing on making that line very, very crisp. And I'll do the same on the other side. Now for my bottom lip, I just followed my natural lip line. On my top lip, I usually go just a tiny, tiny bit above my cupid bow but on the outsides, I will follow my natural lip line. For my top lip, I like to start by tracing my cupid's bow, so then I can go off from there. I make sure that I'm using just the very tip of this applicator to create a really crisp line. Okay, once that looks good, I'll start on the outer corner of my upper lip and then bring it all the way up to my cupid's bow. So 
So if you look closely, you can see that I don't have a super, super crisp line. There's some parts that are a little bit jaggy, jaggedy, jaggy. Um, that's where I will use a brush to clean that up, but we'll get to that in a second. And then I'll just do the same thing on the other side, making sure that I'm just using the tip of the applicator to put the line on. Then I'll just go ahead and take a second and look at my lips to make sure they're symmetrical. Um, this side looks a little bit thinner than this side, so I'm going to work on that. Okay, so now to clean up and to make everything look super, super perfect, I'm going to take a flat concealer brush. This is the Luxie 211 Concealer Brush, which is my favorite like cleanup brush. And then I'll take a little bit of concealer that I used on my face so I know that it matches my skin. I'm just going to take a little bit of that on my concealer brush on both sides, making sure there's not too much. Like, I literally only want a tiny, tiny bit of concealer on there. And I'm just going to slowly make that line super, super crisp. So that is how I apply my liquid lipstick perfectly, perfectly. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. It was probably pretty short, but putting on lipstick is a pretty simple thing to do. I hope that my tips helped you guys out at all. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see from me next. Thank you so much for watching. I love you and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye guys.